And I know it's gonna be hey guys welcome back to my channel my name is oinko if you are new here welcome 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 to every new person who's seen my face for the first time and if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for coming back to watch my content so uh yeah today we're starting a new vlog um in my last vlog i showed you guys our trip to pumalanga i showed you what we did what we got up to at kruger right and i think that was on sunday that we went to kruger so today's wednesday right yeah today is no 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 today's not wednesday today's tuesday actually um yesterday was monday easter monday and we just decided to rest because i don't know sunday's activities took a toll so we did it we needed the rest right and yeah i'm glad we did that yesterday I, I didn't even vlog much yesterday like we were indoors most of the day and then we went to the mall at some point and i just like took some footage of the mall i think i'll insert that here i really like the mall at Pumalanga, by the way went to one called um ilanga mall it's quite big everything in Pumalanga is big anyway <laughs> so yeah it's quite a big mall and it's such a comfy place like they had um games they had an ice rink they had nice restaurants they had um lovely shops basically it was very neat and nice i really liked the mall there whoosh the sunshine <laughs> but yeah um i just needed that time off yesterday because vlogging is work guys and I mean if i'm on a holiday then i also need to get some rest right so yesterday was mostly for resting and i also did some editing for youtube reporting myself <laughs> so yeah um today we are trying to explore more of malanga we um i've heard about god's window i've actually known about god's window for like the longest time and today i'm finally going there the same tour guide we had um at kruger is who's taking us so we are on our way to meet him somewhere now so what's going to happen is we're going to go there park the car and then he's coming there with his own car as well and then he's going to take us on a tour of all the nice places in malanga we're going to god's window we're going to um berlin falls we're going to what's the name of that place something gorge do you, do you remember it uh yeah i can't remember what grass cup or something i don't know see me i'm going somewhere i don't know where i'm going <laughs> but yeah guys i'm just going to make a list of all the places we're going to and i'll probably just leave that here uh yeah so it's about to be a fun day and i can't wait to see all the magic <laughs> that malanga has to offer honestly this trip has just reminded me just like every trip does anyway that god did a thing when he created this earth because the earth is so beautiful and i just pray that every one of us gets to see like nice places whether within or outside of your country just get to see nice places get to appreciate the beauty of the earth at some point and yeah i hope that human beings also learn to love each other because we are the best of all of god's creation love somebody today okay <laughs> okay guys so another thing right see my outfit can you see this pink i'm wearing today i decided i'm not going to wear black do you know why because if you're going to like waterfalls and places that have lots of greenery and stuff you can't just be wearing black and blend in sort of right so i decided to wear pink today so that my pictures are going to pop all the more <laughs> and it's very weird because this shirt is practically like net and the weather forecast for today is like 20 degrees 19 degrees so i have a jacket so these shirts you're going to be seeing it when i'm taking pictures but when you see me walking around chances are you see me wearing a black jacket it's still me i'm still the same person <laughs> but yeah beauty and comfort you must find a way to make them work together all right guys i will see you guys when we get to where our tour guide is and we get on the road guys so we are already here this is the tour guide same person from um the kruger day and this is the car we will be moving in 
So yeah. Say hello. hello. <laughs> We're going to panorama. We're going to potholes, waterfalls. Yay. We're going to We're going to enjoy. <laughs> And don't come to us while you are holding your food. Yes, because it's... So we just arrived at um, God's window and they have a thousand souvenir shops with the nicest things like you can get tiny little souvenirs and you can even get things as intricate as stools like this this is so beautiful now this is beautiful this is nice If you view that side, you can see far from here. So that mm. looks like a gold thing. If you check this side, you can't, it's not it's different with this. Mm. You see this mist. Mm. The mist of the rest. Wow. Yeah, it's how it is. <laughs> Nothing serious. God's window. <sighs> Guys, there are a million stairs in this place. And. I think this is my cue to go back to working out because, oh my gosh, <sighs> my breath, <laughs> I'm breathing like to where we're coming from. Okay, it's not so obvious, but yeah. But yeah, this place is breathtaking, quite literally, <laughs> because where is my breath? <laughs> Ooh, awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Let us go. Unfortunately, you guys, this is breathtaking. My God. My God. Wow. So, do they write their names on it or something? <laughs> Smith, Gerald, Lewis, Gerald, oh, wow. Lewis. Wow. <laughs> nice. Me, I cannot padlock my name anywhere. <laughs> Guys, tourism is hard work. My God, I haven't climbed like this. I don't think I've ever climbed like this in my entire life. Yo, <sighs> I thought I was out of breath before. I'm just getting started. My God, God, Will, how are you doing this? <sighs> You're managing fine. Oh, wow, wow. 
Oh, this place is amazing, babe. We made it to the top. Oh, nice. Oh, so apparently you can actually see the night lights of Maputo from here, which is obviously in Mozambique. This is lovely. Apparently you can also see Kruger, but I'm sure you can't spot any animals. Really nice. Wow. He's on top of the world. Okay. From, maybe from Natal, hmm. Oh, okay. So they drop the seed and then. Oh. Amazing. God's window is beautiful. God's window is beautiful and it will take your breath away. <laughs> I am going to gulp down all this water. I'm so tired. Mila, did you like it? Yeah, I'm tired. <laughs> I'm going to do this on Tuesday, I'm not working. Mm-hmm. I don't know what's going on. Like, I'm so happy that the weather agreed with us today, honestly. Yeah. Like, Mm. So glad. Because when we checked the weather, it was looking it wasn't looking so good. Yeah, it was it was gonna be cloudy oh, and no, rainy so today. Take the chance. <laughs> and look at God. <laughs> photographer <laughs> you see that bridge behind me i was walking on it and that thing was vibrating and we was trying to tell me that every single bridge in the world vibrates and they are kind of like designed to handle vibration do you think this yoruba girl wants to know that like do you think i care about that the only thing i care about is getting as far away from the bridge as possible <laughs> but guys this place is gorgeous i mean it's just amazing like yeah, I love it here. I'm so glad we decided to do this today, honestly. Show you. Yay! This is my husband. Oh, lovely, lovely, lovely. I want to sit down inside the water and enjoy myself. Majestic. Guys, 
I don't know if I'm weird and I find the weirdest things, but why did someone forget their eyelashes here? <laughs> so funny. Look at my hands. just arrived at Berlin Falls and we are going in every single place we've gone to has souvenir shops where you can buy stuff and we've been told that the other waterfall we're going to which is called Lisbon Falls is way nicer than Berlin Falls so yeah we're not going to be here for long because Lisbon is where it's happening but yeah let's go see I've been struggling to get a picture that looks like I'm drinking the water. So like, <laughs> oh my gosh, what am I doing? Yeah, really gorgeous, really nice. And now we are off to Lisbon Falls. Lisbon waterfall and I honestly can't wait to see what this has to give. Ladies and gentlemen, Lisbon Falls, South Africa. I am you guys this is double like there's one on that side and then there's another one that falls this way it is gorgeous and then look at the view it is amazing a gift that keeps on giving because what is this so guys officially we are done with the tour but there is one more place that we want to check out it's called the Samsung Gorge I know that this is like the third time that I have forgotten the name of that place grass cup gorge yes the grass cup gorge and it's more like a I don't know whether to call it like a business so basically you have like all kinds of um, activities to do there 
where you can do zip lines and um, there's like a lift apparently that's what we are trying to do because I don't think we have zip lining in us this very day so yeah we want to see if we can still stop there because our tour guide has a place to be at but we'll try I mean it's not like we're spending so long there guys why am I always out of breath <laughs> yeah it's not like we're spending so long there so we'll see whether we can still catch that and Yet another souvenir market, and I'm sure this is the most expensive one. <laughs> and they have the most beautiful art. You guys, so these are the um, activities that we can do. We have the lift experience, the big swing and the zip line. Now we have done a lot of zip lines and we just, I don't know, I don't think we want to do this. The big swing, this is how much we're going to pay and that is like 1,000 what? 1,300 for both of us. It's not, oh yeah, I'll pay for it, I'll do it. <laughs> no, 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 I'm not doing this because it's expensive. Oh, okay then. And then, oh, <laughs> wait, we'll talk about this after. Let me finish. <laughs> And then this one, this is the one we're doing. So it's like a lift that takes you, I don't know, forest viewing and stuff. Yeah. Oh yeah, let's discuss it. So you, do you want to do the big swing? Why can't you do it? Tell me why. From there, you. I'm not going to swing this. Mm. Wait, let 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 people explain it to us. Please explain it to us, yeah. from there, then down there. So yeah, in down there. It's from not there. that bad. <laughs> yeah, from this people there. From there to here. Hmm. Yeah, you are flying. You fly from there to here. Guys, it can never be me. <laughs> <laughs> You guys, I feel like I can't even do the zip line. Like zip lines, at least you're attached to something vertical the whole time. With the big swing, it's like you drop and then you go. See, I don't play with those things. <laughs> so yeah, we're only going to do the lift and I'm sure that's going to be fun as well. But this place is absolutely gorgeous as well. Uh, I don't know if you can see well. Let me... Yeah, so it has its own waterfall and all the lovely activities. Nice. Nice. So that over there is the zip line, and over here are the swings. But this is what we're doing it's the lift, and it's going to take us all the way down and bring us. I don't know if it's going to bring us back up actually, because somebody did say that like you get to do like a walk back down oh this is perfect look at this so this is what this is where we are at the moment and then it's going to take us down like that and then i think there's like a walking trail that brings us back up here are you excited to get on the swing <laughs> You guys, I just realized they actually put all this. So the crane was on site for two months. They used this much cement, created 146 jobs, and it cost $2.3 million to build this lift. Guys, tourism is amazing. <laughs> you guys, the person who's going to walk behind here is not me. <laughs> it is not me. I'm just going to do the moderate stuff. The man I married though, he is over here 
and i guess he's the bold one in the family because how is he he's not even here he's at the back guys i don't know man i don't know i'm not going there everybody should do their own yeah you guys Mila has convinced me to do the 360 and i am just going to gum myself yeah. to the wall no i'm not checking it's too far please i'm not I'm checking yo god almighty <laughs> What are you doing? I will not be playing. Let me peep, let me be sure of what's going on there. God. God. I know you didn't send me this thing. Please save me. Okay. Okay, I made it. See that human being. See this human being, no. Yay, I love it for her. Okay. Yeah, you can come here. See, check here. No, I'm not checking. This is the big. That's the lift here. Yeah? I'll, I'll show you down. It's, too far. it's going right down. No. What are you doing? I will never. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Tell what's going on here. Yeah, there's someone on the zip line. I can't see. Yay, I love it for her. <laughs> uh -huh, you made it, you see. I made it. Uh -huh. I don't know. Can you tell me why that person is just swinging like that? Oh my goodness. Like, can you see where she went from? What? I feel like if I got on that, I will pass out. Guys. So, it's time to get on the lift. This is what the access card looks like. Hello. Hello. <coughs> Guys, wish me luck. Yeah. We are here. Oh, it is gorgeous. getting to see these amazing plants at first I thought they were like sculptures that were put here for aesthetics or something <laughs> but they turn out to be real plants and there's so much information on them here I will see if I can like type out any of the information but let's look at this 
The largest living thing on earth is a fungus. Oh my goodness. What? Wow. Look at this. World record. <laughs> largest living thing. Oh my goodness. It's amazing stuff. Wait, wait. You guys, we made it back up. Amazing. Back to where we started. Uh, so now we're just waiting for the lift to come get us. Yeah. I guess it's gonna be here soon. Alright guys, this was amazing. I can't talk. I can't. But guys, yeah, I think I will. My battery is very low. My battery is like 10 minutes right now. But this is our last activity for the day. And we're just going off the beach. So when I get back in the car and get my phone charged, I think I will just come around of this video. guys so we just made it back to where the car is back from panorama we're back thank you so much <laughs> everything was what that was good yes it was amazing oh my, you are the best tour guide i'm going to leave your number so that if anybody's coming they no can problem. call you, you <laughs> all right guys ah i am so tired guys like tired and hungry hey baby how are you I'm hungry. <laughs> he's hungry so yeah we are tired we're hungry and we need to eat now I will, we'll just eat here, like there's, let me show you. Yeah, there are a bunch of places here where we can eat. So we'll figure out which one we want and then we'll eat. Mm. Hi. Hello, hi. Oh, okay. Okay, good. Um, yes. Yeah, so, is there an entry? That's, a, That's the only entrance there, right? So it's only one entry. Okay. Hi my love, so I am extremely tired guys and hungry but while I wait for my food I just wanted to come here and round up this video. I also just hope, fingers crossed, that my mic is doing a good job of filtering out the background noise from the traffic because we are literally by the road but guys today was amazing. This is not a day I'm going to forget anytime soon. Everything about today was just it was just God, honestly. It was just beautiful because the planning, we I guess we got our planning perfectly right. Today was the best day to do this, even though according to the weather reports, it was not supposed to be the best day, but somehow it turned out to be. Our planning for everything we did was absolutely perfect. So all together, guys, Malanga has been amazing. I love it here, guys. Like, <laughs> this province is not one, if I'm going to be honest, this province is, this province, 
is not one that I expected the whole world from. Oh, food just no. came. You can just put both of them there. <laughs> Thank you. This is which one? Carbonara. The carbonara, and this is the pescatoria. Which one is the one with the salmon? Salmon. Yeah, so as I was saying, Malanga has been amazing. Guys, because of her, I actually have the things I'm saying written here. It's that bad. <laughs> but yeah, Malanga has been amazing. This province, yeah, what I was saying was that this province is not one I was expecting the whole world from. But honestly, just being here has been amazing. Like, I could live here, honestly. <laughs> I could live here. And I just noticed, you know, like everything here is huge. Especially in Nels fruit, like... Everything is big, the roads are big, the bus stops are big. And then today we went and we saw the mountains and they were huge and the waterfalls are huge and they have the big five, like everything here is just massive. So I really like it here. And I also really like that like today, I feel like I conquered a bunch of fears. Like, yes, I was really afraid when I was doing some of those things because of the heights and the water and the sounds and all that stuff. But even though I didn't do all the extreme things, like I still feel like I conquered a bunch of fairs today and that makes me very happy so guys if Pumalanga is one of the places you've been meaning to go to or just been maybe procrastinating i assure you that you would love it here and i think you should hasten your plans and come over here and just enjoy it have a great time here okay all the places like from kruger national park to all the other parks to all the attractions like um all the places we went today god's window and the rest everything is what it's supposed to be like the things here are massive massive another thing i'm really grateful for honestly is today's weather it was supposed to be 20 degrees and raining so how i was able to survive in this sheer top is what i don't understand and the sun was shining almost the whole day but that's really amazing so i'm grateful that i didn't wear black <laughs> i'm grateful that i wore this bright color because my pictures were popping and i'm grateful that i wore running shoes guys i almost wore white sneakers today and eventually i just went back and i wore running shoes that was like one of the best decisions ever because i know i might have fallen down a few times if i had worn my white sneakers like i was planning to i'm also grateful that we worked with a tour guide right so yesterday we were trying to decide should we just go by ourselves and figure everything out or should we use a tour guide and using a tour guide was an amazing decision honestly because this place is like from where we are parked right now which is like maybe 35 minutes from our hotel all the places we went to today were like almost another maybe one hour to one and a half hour drive and then you're stopping at intervals so i feel like it would have just been stressful if we didn't have a guide who was driving us but because we were able to book like that it it made sense i may not vlog what we get up to tomorrow because right now we're really tired we're leaving from Alanga on thursday and tomorrow is wednesday so tomorrow might just be like a resting day so that we can drive you know all the way back home and i don't know i just feel like we shouldn't really vlog <laughs> so forgive me if you don't see any vlogs that um talk about wednesday but we're not even going straight home we're going somewhere else on thursday so and it's not it's nothing fancy it's nothing too serious but i'm going to vlog anyway so you're going to get, get that vlog even if you don't get anything from tomorrow tomorrow i just want to rest and have peace and maybe do some admin work here and there but yeah tomorrow is going to be a very soft day don't worry if you want to see more details about the trip what it costs what um how to book for stuff and all that i'm going to do a separate video on kruger a separate video on all the panorama activities that we did today so that you can get like a sense of how to book how to go to all these places and stuff like that like i'm going to dedicate a separate video to all those um all those very important details in case you are looking to travel here so don't worry about that and now i cannot keep my eyes off my food so i'm going to leave you guys here thank you so so much for watching Thank you so much for joining us on this trip. It's been amazing vlogging this because it's just like I'm keeping the memories. Like it's one thing to take pictures and just random videos, but vlogging is a whole other experience because I feel like in 10 years time, I can come back to this video and see exactly how I felt in that moment, right? So yeah, um, thank you for watching. Thank you for being here. Please, please, please don't forget to like this video so that more people can see it. It really helps the channel grow. Please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. And please share this with somebody who you think might enjoy watching. Um, up to eat now. I can't. I can't. I can't concentrate, guys. <laughs> Bye.